What is up, boys? We got 22 hours until the new featured program on a Friday. I'm going to give you guys the best method to preload XP for the new method. So literally, you hop on, you'll have literally hundreds of thousands of XP, um, maybe even more, depending on how much you grind right now. We only got 22 hours, so it's going to be kind of difficult. But with that being said, um, I got a few methods for you guys. One really good method, one solid method. Before we do hop in it, make sure you guys drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new so you guys never miss another tips video, stub method. I'll, we drop endless content on this channel, so make sure you guys subscribe, turn on the notice, all that good stuff. Also, we will not be talking about the Road of the Show method. Everyone already knows that method, so really no point in talking about it. If you guys do want to learn the Road of the Show method, which is a really good method to get XP, look back on my channel. I have a few videos talking about the Road of the Show method. It's a really good method. I just don't really want to talk about it because everyone's already talked about it. We, pretty much everyone already knows it, and uh, it's not my favorite method either. It's a cool method, but it does get repetitive and boring. Let's get into the first method. Um, this is, Like I said, we got one decent method and one really good method. Um... This is kind of like just a whatever method. If you get bored of like the main method, let's just get into like the crappier method first. We're going to be talking about BR. So um, right now you guys can preload some wins. You know what I mean? Get right before uh, 10 wins. And uh, pretty much all you guys want to do is play BR. I dropped a video yesterday on how to complete BR as fast as possible. You guys can complete BR in probably about a day or at least the, the, the section that we want to complete. Um... So if you guys want to learn how to complete BR fast, go watch that video. I'm not going to really explain that in this video. I'm just going to explain what you guys get in this. So if you guys complete 100 BR points, as you guys can see, all these little uh, rewards, 70 BR points, 75, not only are you getting packs, but you're also getting XP, 2.5K, 2.5K, 5K, 5K, 10K. If you add up all of those XPs, you guys are getting 40, 47,500 XP just guaranteed xp that's not considering gameplay xp that's not considering nothing like that that's just complete straight up forty-seven thousand xp is this something to do if you're getting bored of grinding the mindless grind of what i'm about to show you which is way better of a method but it's just a mindless grind you'll probably get around 50 60 cake with gameplay you'll probably get your first few choice packs for like the bronze and silvers and you'll be right before like the henchman diamonds by no means is that like a crazy XP method, anything like that. This is a cool little method that normally talks about. There's a lot of XP in BR. I would recommend playing a little bit of BR before this event drops or before the program drops. 47k XP is pretty good, especially if you're playing online, just having fun, messing around. Uh, good little method for you guys. Now, let's go ahead and get into the main method. If you guys go to the program and scroll all the way down to the bottom, looking at March to October... This is a very good method. In about three to four hours, you guys can complete this entire thing. The higher difficulty you guys play on, the more XP you guys will get. So you guys, if, you, if there's some sweaties out there, you guys can play on Legend, Hall of Fame, All-Star. Um, for me, I started off on All-Star. It wasn't that it was too difficult. It was just a lot of BS would happen for me, and I get frustrated. When I'm like, when I'm just grinding, I just want to mindlessly grind, listen to music, watch YouTube, Netflix, whatever it is. I like to mindlessly grind. So with that being said, I played on Veteran. Um, you do lose a little bit of uh, XP, as you guys can see. At the All-Star break, you lose about 3.5K. In the season, you lose 3.5K. So you lose a little bit of XP, but it's also quicker on Veteran, because you guys are going to be winning a lot more, a lot quicker, uh, at least for me. Uh, it, it, it's all on you guys. If you guys want to play on Veteran, All-Star, or even Hall of Fame, it's all on you guys. It does not matter. Uh, Veteran is very easy. So, all you guys want to do is go to the main menu right here is March or October, right next to Diamond Dynasty. Go in and start new. Uh, not, none of this matters. You guys can pick whatever team. I would recommend picking, obviously, a good team. I don't know why you would pick, you know, a crappy team. It makes no sense to me, but I picked the Dodgers for my first time around. I'm going to pick, uh... We'll pick, the, we'll pick the Braves this time around, just so we know we have different teams and we're not confused. Uh, I'll pick the Braves, and right here is where you choose your difficulty. Um, like I said, I use Veteran. Um, a little method you guys can do is start on All-Star or Hall of Fame, see how it goes for you, and then after that you can lower your difficulty in-game. Um, the only thing is you cannot hire difficulty. You cannot Once you guys lower it, you cannot hire it, so... Uh, you know, maybe try Hall of Fame, maybe try All-Star. If it's too hard for you, then you guys can lower it. Because like I said, you guys cannot hire difficulty. You guys can only lower it. So I'll start on Hall. 
So All Star and Hall of Famer All Star. You guys, you guys will be in opening day. I think it usually starts you. Last time it started me in the sixth inning, so it's not too bad. And um, you guys want to win every game, obviously. You guys can go ahead and complete this yourself. Like I said, you guys start in the sixth inning. Um, last time I started pitching, so this is a little bit different. I guess we're starting to hit here. And yeah, just complete this game. You guys want to win every game to get your momentum up. And uh, let me show you guys what it looks like when you guys do finally complete your first game. All right, so my first game, we won in the ninth inning. Just barely. Like I said, in All-Star, you really got to lock in a little bit. Not not too crazy, but you do have to, like, lock in and try a little bit when it comes to hitting. Which I just don't like doing on All-Star. I like, when I'm grinding XP, I like just to chill. But, uh, as you guys see right here, key moment. Get opening day win. Success. Um, this is where you guys want to get your dubs. You guys get momentum. Momentum skips uh, games. You guys get wins. Obviously, you guys want to win these games. So you guys can make the playoffs and stuff like that. So, um, for the people that don't really understand March October or never played it, I've never played it really either. Pretty much all it is is a bunch of it's a bunch of moments. That's all it really is. Um, some moments like opening day, you play three, four innings. Some moments you play with just one player. Like I played with just uh, Cody Ballinger one game. Just play with him for the whole game, so it's kind of like a road of the show game. Uh, one game, I just had to get a walk off, or it was like the ninth inning. I had to pitch one inning and then hit a home run or end the game. So it's just a bunch of easy moments. And after you guys win, you guys get momentum, and it skips games for you. And you guys obviously want to win those games that it skips. Essentially, you guys want to play all that. Let me let me exit out here. Essentially, you, you guys want to play all that all the way up until the All Star break, right before the All Star break. So the reason you guys want to play up until the All-Star break is you guys can see right here. You guys can literally play all the way up to the All-Star break. And then right when the new program drops, bam, play the, play the all, get to the All-Star break. Easy 5 to 9k XP just by getting to the All-Star break. You literally just play one game or just simulate to the All-Star break. Bam, you have that free XP. Go to the end of the season, you guys get all that XP. Uh, playoff wins, you get that XP. World Series wins, you guys get that XP. So it's just an easy method. Get to the All-Star break. Do not get to the actual All-Star break. Get, like, right before it. And then just play the rest of the season and get all that free V or all the free XP. And the thing that is perfect about this method is you guys can make as many March Octobers as you guys want. So you guys can go out, really grind this today and tomorrow before the new program drops. Get five, get ten March October uh, save files all right before the All-Star break. And then right when the new program drops, bam, play all five and ten of those new files you guys have and just reap all of that XP. So, I mean, it, there's only 22 hours, and then by the time you guys watch this video, it'll probably be even less hours. So, uh, it's going to be a little bit hard to make a bunch of uh, save files, but if you guys watch this in time, you guys should be able to make two to three uh, March Octobers right before All-Star break, and then right when the new program drops, bam, just grind them all out, get to the end of the season, get the World Series dub. And then just keep you guys can keep repeating that as well. If you guys want to just keep repeating this method, you guys can. I think after you guys uh, preload some XP and get all that done, I would recommend either doing BR after that or the uh, Road to the Show method. One of those two methods is probably better. This method, as far as like XP per hour, is not that good, but it's only good because you guys can get all that grind out of the way that you don't really get any XP and then reap all the rewards very quickly right when the new program drops so yeah let me know if, let me know if you guys need any help in the comments let me know how it goes for you guys i'm excited for this new program i'm gonna be grinding as always i will see you guys in tomorrow's video and before you guys leave do not forget to drop a like subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already comment uh comment october mamba if you have made it to the very end of the video october mamba so i know who made it to the very end as always i'll catch you guys in the next video see you guys tomorrow everyone have a good day peace